Hi, welcome to Welcome to Sharon's Crochet Corner. Um, I wanted to hop on and just um, say a very happy Thanksgiving to all our Canadian crocheters. It's a weekend that you give thanks uh, across Canada. And the United States also have a long weekend this weekend as well. And you'll have to forgive me, but I forget what the weekend's called. Sorry, I didn't mean to forget, but I know in the States that you have um, a long weekend as well. But uh, this is a time when we all give thanks. Also, um, I wanted to tell you that um, I'm in the process of writing up my patterns for uh, my sweater top that I made, plus the sweaters I did for the twins. They have them now, and they tried them on them, both of them, and they love them. Uh, apparently, my crocheting made it cr a great hit. Also, being as uh, the coral one I did was larger, I only did the one. So now I'm doing the other one in the same yarn. It's the um, Snuggly Wuggly Big uh snuggly wuggly big okay and it's a uh, three weight and it's very soft and it made a really nice sweater for the other one and it was bigger so that it'll fit them a little a bit longer because i don't think those ones are going to fit them too long because they grow very quickly as you know anyway I just wanted to come on real quick to say this is my next project. Also, I'm working on my shrug. I've gotten a little further, but not much. But it, it's coming along, so I'll get there soon, I hope. Anyway, and shout outs. Um, everybody deserves a shout out in our crochet community, being as we all get along and we all enjoy and have fun together. If we have a problem, uh, most times in our crochet lives, somebody will answer or be able to help, which is really nice because um, there are crocheters out there that do have problems and I'm one of them. Uh, you're not all perfect, I'm sure. And it's nice to be able to ask somebody if you um, are not, doing something proper how do you fix that it's really nice that somebody says this is what you do and it will work out for you i like that very much and so far as people are concerned i've never had such a great community and i really love you all i can't wait for my first happy mail <laughs> everybody says oh the happy mail that people get are unbelievable and I know it's hard for people to send to Canada. And I understand that. It's it's crazy. Our postal service is nuts. They charge so much. It even charges so much to go from Ontario to here. It's expensive. It's, it's a disaster. And I don't know why. And we don't get weekend service either. We just get Monday to Friday. And that's all we get. And they go on strike so many times a year because of money or they want more money or whatever. It's really sad. It happens. And it just drives you crazy. I, I don't know why, but people just... Anyway, if you haven't been to the um, Crafty Floridian, you need to go try out Billy. <laughs> She's a hoot. Also, Bagaday Crochet. Um... Crystal is a really nice person, and her giveaways are beautiful. I know not all people like it, but you know what? It is what it is, and she just does random giveaways that, oh, wow, make your head spin because there's so much yarn, like goodness, there. And I know it's one person that wins, but you know what? She does another one 
So you enter each time, and you only enter to win. If you don't enter, you can't win anything. And I don't think it's fair to run her down for what she does because she's a beautiful person. She's got a heart of gold, and I like her. I've followed her since 2006 or seven when she only had a little cell phone, and it was really awesome then. She's learned so much since then too. So, and she's taught me a lot, an awful lot. I've made so many things by Crystal. And if you haven't been to Z, um, uh, Zelda NRJ3, go and check out Z. She's really nice. And she's got a heart of gold too. And also, you always know that to go to Granny D. <laughs> uh, Nip Pearl and Squirrel. She's also really, really nice. And I really love her to bits. There's also... Um, Many, many others. I'm trying to think of everybody. Petra. Petra's Happy Place. Uh, she's another one. Go and check her out. And um, Paisley Ann Creative with Penny. She's another one that's really nice. And she does a lot of um, yarn uh, goodness. And she tells you who's got yarn on sale. So that's awesome too. And Rose likes crochet. Rose is an awesome person. God love her. She does many, many things. She's got lots of yarn. But you know what? She finds everything to do with that yarn. So it's awesome. And I love her to bits. So so will you. She's really nice. And her daughter, Carrots. So go check her out. Plus, you might like the um, Fiber Spider. He's another one that is really, really nice. And he has beautiful tutorials and easy to follow. Uh, I really like him for that because a lot of times we um, are slower than what he is. But he does it so nice for us. He takes his time. And I like that. Not, some of them go too fast for me. And I have to always go back. And I know that you have to go back a bit. But some of them go, wow, really fast. And it's really hard for me. So I really like somebody that takes their time and doesn't go as fast as whatever. And there's just so many I'd like to give shout outs to, but then I forget them. <laughs> Not deliberately, trust me. It's just that you, um, you tend to just not put everything together. And that's me. I can really tell you that. And uh, I can tell you also um, some of the people that you might want to go and see, like, um, that I like. Uh, Rolling in Yarn. That's another one that's really, really nice. Um, also, um, there's, oh, Michelle uh, Shipper. She's really, really awesome. You might want to go and check her out because she's beautiful. I know I have <laughs> so many um, people that I could name and not go crazy with, but uh, Crochet Rocks. Uh, Tracy's really nice. You'd like Tracy. Crochet A and Left is Right Crochet. There are a few more that are awesome people too and they have a lot of crochet and uh also left is right crochet it she's left-handed and she's teaching people now how to do things in a tutorial left-handed i think that's amazing i'm left-handed but i had to learn to crochet right-handed when i was young because there weren't any left-handed people uh not that could show me how to do that also, another lady that's really nice is Rolling Through Life. She's really nice. That's Wanda. So there's a few for you. And I know I've got others that are really nice too, but I can't think of everybody. Oh, the Dabbling Hook. That's another one. Uh, wow. Uh, she's really nice as well. You'd like her. And Dana Wonderless 
crochet she's another lady that's really nice and the dabbling hook her name is um i just had it and i forgot it oh well that wasn't nice of me i had it right on the tip of my tongue and it's gone i'm sorry that's very rude of me wow i'm really sorry wow make and do crew she's another lady that i really like too i go and i i visit these people and it's not that i'm going to crochet from them but i go and look at what they've got and maybe something catches my eye and i'd like to try it as well so that i really enjoy um, there's a few that, um, Lisa's crochet, Lisa's very nice. There's a few that I watch that aren't crochet either. And they're a lot of fun, especially in cooking. <laughs> they are really fun. Um, the gentleman I watch is from Pennsylvania and his wife, Kathy, uh, they are literally amazing and they do a lot of pressure cooking, uh, recipes which is really nice because i have two pressure cookers and i enjoy that because i need to do something fast because i can't stand that long to prepare a meal so i look forward to doing things that make it easy for me so i revert to either crock pot or i do my pressure cookers which makes life easier for me especially for standing because it's so hard on me and i i don't like to be able uh, I can't fall that's just not in the cards I've done that too many times and I have to do something that's safe so you might want to check out um his channel too one day and I'm sure you'd like him it's Rick Romana and <laughs> I'll put a link to him in the description box because I might have said his name wrong but um, it's Rick R A M M A N A and his wife, Kathy, <laughs> they're a scream. They really are. <laughs> You'd really like him, especially when he makes his pizza. He's something else. Anyway, I just wanted to come on and say thank you everybody for letting me into your hearts. It means so much and I'm still so nervous because it's like talking to myself and I'm thinking, am I going to do this right? Or am I going to say something wrong? Or I repeat and I don't mean to. Don't get me wrong, please. I don't mean to repeat, but I do. And again, to all my new subscribers, I can't thank you enough. It means so much to me and your comments. Wow. Your comments are beautiful. I haven't had anybody now tell me that they don't like my videos or to run me down i i really respect that and it i don't mean to hurt anybody i hope i never ever do that because uh, that's not me and it's like being so hard like this weekend i lost my daughter 10 years ago this weekend and it kind of hurts very much and I miss her every day but I have my yarny people that help me through this situation even it's 10 years that she passed away and it just seems like it was yesterday and it breaks my heart being as she was disabled as well from birth too but not with what I had. She had Walderbank syndrome and it was the first case in history. I don't think there's, there's ever been another person with it, but it's so not nice to deal with. But I had 37 years with her and that says something. Again, oh. well, thank you all for listening to me. And I hope I didn't babble on too much. But it, I really didn't mean to, honest. I hope you all take care. 
And please enjoy your Thanksgiving weekend. And remember to give thanks. And look after the shut-ins that can't get out. Maybe they would like a turkey dinner if you have extra that you could send off to them. I'm sure that they would appreciate it because a lot of them can't get out. And Emil always says the best when you can give thanks to other people. So again, thank you all from the bottom of my heart. And it means a lot to me, as I said. Take care. Enjoy your weekend. Bye for now.